Welcome back. As you can see, Joe Root has now landed on the House at LBW Review Square. Notice I have not moved the marker forward yet because we need to perform the scenario. We are still in the bowling place scenario as well, but we need to perform this scenario during the bowling place scenario. So, this is how the LBW um, works. We need to check Hawkeye to see whether the ball or the dice in this case was going on to hit the stumps. So here we've got the stumps, they get positioned in the stumps circle like so, and I get a shot now from the from the bowler's square, the bowler circle, the one with the F on it. Okay, you're allowed to move your fielder out the way if it's a if it's interfering with the flick. So I'm going to now aim at my flick, and if I hit the stumps, Joe Root is out LBW. If I miss, that means the ball was missing the stumps, and Joe Root is not out. Let's see what happens. I hit. Okay, just nicking the off stump. Right, so Joe Root is now out LBW. So what we need to do is move him back to where the marker was here on square 34 because those runs don't count. So in the score book, I would then write that Joe Root was out LBW and he scored 34 runs. So we write down 34, just like so. He then returns to the batting pavilion and the next player comes out. And in this case, it's going to be the batting captain. 